Hi, I'm Judith St. Clair. Welcome to my studio. Today we're going to talk about gemstones. Gemstones are classified by hardness, like for instance, the diamond is a number 10 on the Mohs scale because it can scratch any stone rated, any stone below it, and none can scratch a diamond. Where talc can't scratch anything, and everything can scratch talc. So it's rated at a 1. Obsidian falls right in the middle at 5 or 5.5 5 on the Mohs scale. The gems that we're going to talk about today is obsidian. Now you're thinking, as I thought when I first considered obsidian, obsidian, a gemstone? I don't think so. Obsidian is not a stone. It's not a gem. Obsidian is what? Glass, of course, duh. Okay, so obsidian is glass, but it's a special glass. Obsidian is nature's glass and deserves a special place in our consideration. Now it has special properties. Obsidian is the sharpest thing there is that we all know about. In fact, Surgical blades are made of obsidian. Good ones are. The surgical blades are also made of steel, but an obsidian surgical blade is sharper than a, the sharpest steel surgical blade. Think about that. And it's a, a thing that happens naturally. Let me show you a few pieces of obsidian that I have. Here's an obsidian rock they call it. Well, we all know it's glass, right? And uh, it has a lot of sharp, sharp edges on it. I, I certainly wouldn't want to hold it really tight or run my fingers along the, the edges of it. And I have some obsidian beads. In the early days, the uh, Native Americans made arrowheads and spearheads out of obsidian. And uh, Today, we make beautiful beads. These are 14 millimeter round obsidian beads, and you can tell how beautiful and shiny they are. It's so, so smooth, and of course, like glass, you know, glass is always cool to the touch. And then I have a necklace I made from these the same 14 millimeter obsidian beads. This is a, a necklace with sterling silver, little small sterling silver beads in between the obsidian, and then there are, are end caps of cloisonne, black cloisonne. And then the other one I have is a, um, a set, a necklace of 20 millimeter obsidian beads. These are heavy. But it's a beautiful necklace and it, it's great at the top of a sweater. And then the last piece I have, and these are little teardrop beads. This is rainbow obsidian and I don't know if you could tell because it's so shiny. There's a, a hint of uh, rainbow colors, greens I think and blues mostly. And it's from, from different uh, uh, minerals that are in the the silicon when it blows I'm up. I'm not out of the volcano. usual model, but let me show you the 20 millimeter beads, obsidian beads, of course. That's what we're talking about. And that get this off, and then I'll show you the look of the. 14 millimeter beads. They can be either this length or they can be lengthened quite a lot. That's my presentation for today. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.